Hi, this is Class Creatives, and today we're going to be covering how to install Epic Unreal's art rigging tools into Autodesk Maya for Mac. It's a common question that a lot of our students ask us, how can we install these tools for Mac versus PC? And there are a few different steps involved for getting the tools to work on Mac, but rest assured the tool does work on Mac. So you just need to follow a few different steps to install these tools on a Mac versus a PC. So the first thing you want to do on your desktop is press the option button and click on go. And by pressing the option button, that is going to unhide the library folder. And when you go into that library folder, that is going to be the location where all of your Maya install information is going to be housed. The next thing you're going to want to locate is your Maya Art Tools zip folder that you've downloaded from our course lecture. This folder is going to contain both your PC and your Mac versions for the install tools to work with Autodesk Maya. A lot of questions we do have from a lot of students is asking if these tools are compatible with the latest version and previous versions of Maya. We've tested all the way back to Maya 20. 15, 16, and 17, and these tools work in older versions of Maya, and they also work in the latest version of Maya in 2020, and we don't foresee that changing and not being compatible with any other future versions of Maya. So it is pretty much going to work for whatever version of Maya that you're using within the last five to seven years. So once you've located your folder, what you're gonna to wanna to do then is you're going to want to locate your user setup Python script. And now that script is the most important script because that is going to be what is talking to Maya essentially to locate your Maya auto rigging toolkit folder from Epic Unreal. Now, the most difficult thing that I found when you're installing this into your Mac OS is the location of where this user setup PY needs to be placed on the forum for Epic Unreal, the creator Jeremy Ernst, who created this tool, recommends installing it into your Maya scripts folder, which is located in that library section that we talked about earlier in the video. However, this did not work for me. I copied old preferences and in, into my Maya install, and I did not use the default preferences. And so my location needed to be installed into the Autodesk Maya 2020 pref scripts folder. I was not able to install the art tools unless I installed the PY script into that location. So you may also need to install your PY script in a slightly different location than what the recommended location is. So once you've replaced that file, all you need to do then is relaunch Maya. Make sure that you have Maya closed when you're replacing these scripts. If you have it open, you can um, close it down and then relaunch it. And then what you'll be getting is a prompt. Don't freak out, it's not going to be an error. It's just wondering for your first time when you launch Maya, it's gonna be asking where this folder is that houses your Maya tools. Now this Maya tools is what we unzipped earlier in the video. That folder can be placed anywhere you'd like. You can place it in documents, you could place it on the desktop, you could place it in the same folder that has your user PY. So it doesn't really matter where you place it, but just keep in mind where you're installing that folder because it is going to ask you for that location. Once you've located that location and pointed that browse button into the folder where you have your art tools located then you can go ahead and click on the epic games drop down menu and then you can go ahead and add a character when you first add your character you might notice that the mannequin is asking for another file and this file is the export maya file now this file is also included in our folder that you get when you download our tools. You just need to browse to that same folder and it's basically located in the animation rigging tools, Maya tools, general art project sample export files. And then there's an, a mannequin version. Make sure you use the PC version. If you don't, you're going to get a different type of mannequin, which you see in this video here, this purple version. It's a little bit slightly less uh, refined and that is the version that is in the Maya folder for the Mac. If you want to have the PC version that you're used to seeing, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and browse to 
that mannequin that you see in the PC folder, not the Mac folder. And that's basically all you need to do to install the Maya art rigging tools for Unreal and getting it working on your Mac. And you'll be ready to go and animate just like you would if you were working on a PC.